there was jealousy between the sisters. I didn't know they had this dark side in them. It's hard to imagine family turning on each other to this extent. I would never want to have my sister. Twisted Sisters, all new series premieres Monday, September 3rd at 10, only on Investigation Discovery. All of our blessings that we have now are because we have a guardian angel, which is my dad by our sides. I think that The Fox Sisters. On December 11, 1847, the Fox family 
moved to a modest house in the small village of Hydesville, New York, in the United States, where communication between the seen and the unseen began. The Fox family consisted of John and Margaret and their children, including the two daughters, Margarita and Catherine Fox, ages 14 and 12, respectively. During this time, raps were heard in a cottage and Mrs. Fox sought to explain away the noises, but they continued, became stronger, furniture was moved, the touch of a cold hand was felt, and additional phenomena took place. On the night of March 31st, 1848, the phenomena began again. There were a series of very strong and continued sounds. Katie challenged the invisible power. Now, do just as I do. Count one, two, three, four, she said, and the raps came as asked immediately. Mrs. Fox decided to put the phenomena to a test. She asked the noise to rap the different ages of her children. Instantly, she heard the correct ages of her children, including the age of Emily, who had passed on in infancy. Mrs. Fox then proceeded to ask questions. Is this a human being that answers my questions so correctly? There was no response. She then asked, Is it a spirit? If it is, make two raps. The response was an immediate two raps. So Margaret began a sort of interview. It was revealed that a man had been murdered in the house about five years before, on a Tuesday at midnight, and buried the next night, ten feet below the surface of the cellar. The spirit stated that he had been murdered for the sum of $500. Through an alphabetic combination of the raps, the identity of the victim and his killer were found. The family calls the neighbors to witness the phenomena. So in a few days, the house began to be visited by an increasing number of curious people. At the time of the phenomena, the two girls, Margaret and Kate, were removed from their home since they suspected that the phenomena were linked to the presence of both. However, the noises followed the Fox sisters. At the same time, the same phenomena were already happening in the homes of other families. This led to a spiritualist wave, which passed from America to Europe, where the field was already prepared for its study, aligned with scientific development. The most common way of manifestation in Europe was the turning tables. Phenomenon that caught the attention of philosophers, being one of them, the intellectual Hippolyte Léon Denizard Rivelle, future Alan Kardec.
Walking Lips' Kylie Jenner recently posted, then deleted, a photo of a Baphomet, which is a three-eyed goat typically associated with the devil and the occult. Photo's caption, this is Rob Kardashian, LOL. Kylie's dig at her brother Rob may be the result of rumors that the male Kardashian is dating exotic performer Black China. While new relationships happen regularly in the Kardashian clan and its various offshoots, this one could be particularly upsetting to the 18-year-old Kylie. Kylie's boyfriend Tyga used to date and has a baby by Black China. is I'll hold on to an object. Mm -hmm. um, did you bring any objects today at all? I did, I oh, have an object. Cool, great. Yeah. And maybe yeah. hold on to it and we'll go from there. Perfect. <laughs> that's, oh my my ob God. that's my yes. little object. That's so sweet. I brought a stuffed animal toy monkey that was my father since he's been a child. And when Tyler was reading my mom, he kept gathering, someone has a monkey. I don't know, I keep saying a monkey. And I was in the other room like, oh my God, I have the monkey. Like, my mom didn't even remember the monkey's name. <laughs> okay, so let me just, I'll scribble, I'll just kind of communicate everything that's coming through and then we'll kind of backtrack and I'll ask you what makes sense. Okay. So let's see. Okay. There's a feeling that comes across, and it is in reference to Dad's passing. Mm -hmm. There's a feeling of not having full closure of like being actually to be there in the moment of mm -hmm. passing. There's a feeling of like I don't want you to be here mm -hmm. when I'm actually passing away. It's like I, I, for your sake, I want you to just not have that in your memory. So just I, because he passed when they weren't there, I think. Right. And there's a feeling when this comes through that he actually would have timed his passing. And the feeling is that he was holding on mm -hmm. and he was waiting. Right. And um, that would have been done with purpose and mm -hmm. with intention. Yeah. His parents didn't know he was dying. Right. Um, he just kept it a secret. So he wanted them to come and see him. Right. And then he wanted to say goodbye to them and like say goodbye to all of us. And then after everyone left, he ended up like passing away. And that was his way of having closure. So please know that. Aww. <laughs> This was my dad's stuffed animal since he's been a baby. Right. And he always kept it in his closet and just always had it. Right. And um, when he was dying, we had a hospice at our home and he kept asking for the monkey. The monkey's name is Jocko. And it was in his bed like when he passed away. It's something I've had since he's passed away and I've kept it with me at every house that I've had or whatnot. So it's, you know, like really sentimental to me. So it's a beautiful thing to have. Tyler be able to channel that for me. Kim Kardashian is fighting baby blues by, wait for it, eating her placenta. St. West's mom revealed Monday that she freeze dried her placenta and is snacking on it in pill form. She says after learning of her body parts health benefits, she thought, what do I have to lose? On her app, Kim writes, I really didn't want the baby blues and thought I can't go wrong with taking a pill made of my own hormones made by me for me. 
Kim gives her own placenta a ringing endorsement, writing, I had great results and felt so energized and didn't have any signs of depression. Hey, Ron, have you ever cooked a placenta? Cooked a placenta? Personally, no. Placenta? They say you can eat them. Back in 2013, Kim thought about eating it when she was first pregnant with North. No, that is the most disgusting thing I've ever heard. Why? I think everyone's just being really weird and closed minded. Except for Courtney. I mean, she gets it. So much, in fact, Courtney actually pranked her family into thinking they ate placenta on Keeping Up with the Kardashians. Okay, there's so much flavor on it, though. Kim Kardashian freaks out over mom Kris Jenner's look-alike wax figure, which she keeps at her house. I'm really freaking out. During Kris's annual holiday dinner party with family friends Chrissy Teigen and John Legend, Kim came face to face with her mom's waxy twin. Well, it's so you can visit with me and not have this to listen to me talk to you. It's so realistic. Where did you get this? Hollywood Wax Museum. Stop. They made one for me. I can't even tell you how creepy and amazing this is. Like it's exact down to the little mark she has. Like everything about it, you guys. This is her exact hairline. Chrissy was even mesmerized by the mannequin. It's never a dull moment. <laughs> Chris isn't the only one with a doppelganger. All of her daughters have several around the globe. I love that. Kim received her first figure in 2010, and it donned an Hervé Leger dress, of course. My heart and soul. The reality star's figure in England lets you take a selfie with it. It's always so much fun. I feel like it's like old times. Chris's daughter, Kendall, has also got a few. But the one on display in England matches her to a T. <laughs> this is actually really <laughs> Kylie Jenner unveiled her wax figure in 2017. She donated the custom Balmain gown she wore for her debut at the 2016 Met Gala the same dress that left her legs scratched up. We all want to be cute over here, okay? <laughs> Both Chloe and Courtney have some of their own as well, which are on display in New York and Las Vegas. This is insane. But nothing beats Chris's creepy copy. I literally knew I was coming up here and I still got startled seeing this. Her wax figure to have just sitting at her bar. Like insane.
wings, no fire.